Greetings one and all. Thank you for tuning into another episode on the Money Council. The previous episode I discussed the concept of goal setting. Now in this episode I'd like to pinpoint something that we all as human beings are faced with when trying to set and achieve those important goals. A few years ago I had a conversation with an acquaintance who by all accounts would be considered well achieved and successful. He owned his own textile business, owned multiple properties, driving the best cars and traveling the world. He told me that he wants to make some big changes in his life. He wants to cut back on things and take a back seat while he slowly unwinds from running his business. So my question to him was that you created a successful business and made quite a bit of money through this process. Why has it not happened yet that you've begun giving up control of your business? The biggest issue he faces now is that none of his kids are actively interested in participating and taking over the business. Simultaneously, he also doesn't want to fully give up all his control of the business. So when we are thinking about our goals, it's usually really important in our life. Something that is connected to our careers, or business interests, our families, or some sort of personal achievement. When you reflect on your goals and finding difficulty in achieving it, a valid question to ask yourself is, how much do you really want it? Most cases, it would either be that you feel you want it so much that you'll do whatever it takes, or you feel that it's impossible to achieve now. If it's the latter response, that you think it's impossible to achieve, ask yourself with complete conviction, in your capacity, what have you done to help achieve those goals? Second, have you made any sacrifices as yet? Instinctively, you can find that certain of these goals that you had in mind has already been discarded without even trying to achieve them. And we as human beings can relate to this. Perhaps share the guilt of giving up on goals without even attempting to reach it. We feel that the goal is out of reach already. If the, only, if the only goal that really matters to you, then it probably involves some sort of sacrifice. The sacrifice of money, time, energy, other relevant goals, irrelevant goals, and so on. It's challenging to sacrifice short-term gratification in order to stay focused. The goal really matters you that you should be worth sacrificing for. So before you decide on those new stylish wireless earbuds or those stylish stilettos, ask yourself the question, what are you prepared to sacrifice to achieve your important goals? Thank you for tuning in once again. Please hit the subscribe button, like and share this video with those who may benefit from the content. I thank you and God bless.